another test, another eBay account, and another strategy. But this time our account got suspended immediately, even before we listed one product. So this situation happens to a lot of dropshippers and it's so frustrating. So let's see what to do fr from this situation from A to Z, how to open any eBay account that got uh, suspended immediately. Hello everybody. So in this video, I want to share with you the full process that I made to open this account. A lot of people are opening accounts right now and struggling with actually just uploading their first product because they can't getting blocked immediately. So what to do to fix that? Let's see. So this is the first message that we got on March 19. Um, your eBay account has been suspended. Let's open this message. So your eBay account has, uh, has been suspended, uh, suspended because uh, all these things uh, has, have been removed. A message that a lot of people already got and know what is this message. So let's see what to do from this situation. The first thing that we do, we go to Google and we write eBay contact. Then we go to eBay customer service. We click on email us, then we click on um, account, account holds restrictions and suspensions, email us and we got a form that we can fill to contact eBay. So let's see the form. Here is the form. So here we, should, we write our message. Now let's see what I sent and you just need to write it in your words. Actually, it's not me. It's one of our uh, virtual assistant that helps us with all of our projects and to manage for me the 35 even more now eBay stores. So let's see how it works. So in this form, that's what we send them. Here was the message that our VA sent them. It was a bit funny, but it worked. I'm a husband, a husband and father of three little children and I created my eBay account around two weeks ago to start buying and selling my used for, for, uh, for nature. And I just realized that my account got blocked. Can you please clarify why I got suspended and what I can do to get it unsuspended? Okay, so that was the email that we sent them. Very quickly, around maybe 24 hours, we got this email from eBay. So um, here is the eBay message and what are the items that you are planning to purchase on our site, how you are going to pay and some questions. All what we did is to read the questions and understand what eBay wants us to tell them. So here was our reply. So the main points here are, are you selling personal stuff or you have a supplier? Uh, estimated time, how many items do you plan to list and stuff like this. The basic uh, questions of eBay. So let's see what we replied to eBay. So I go to the next message that I got from them. Not here. Okay, so here is the message that our uh, virtual assistant uh, replied to their question. I will go to buy groceries. Um, my basement is full of old stuff. So we are telling to eBay that we just want to list some uh, products that we have on our house, on our apart apartment. Um, what you want to list. So we can write here everything actually. Um, in another account, we just wrote here home and garden. I was selling personal stuff or you have a supplier. So I, I wrote that for now we just have some stuff on our basement. So that's what we are selling. Um, I don't think that uh, I will ship internationally, but six to 10 days inside the United States. You can write there actually anything. 
Just reply to their message. Just try to think what eBay wants to hear. So after we wrote them all these uh, answers that we will send, sell between 30 to 100 um, products. And here are the prices. We write 40 to 50 dollars. The last question is very important. Don't write something which is too uh, expensive. Also about what you're planning to sell. Don't write things like electronics because it's high risk products that eBay doesn't like. So what happened after this uh, message that we sent to eBay? Actually, we got the very uh, interesting message reply. Your eBay account is reinstated. Boom. Our account was open. It was so easy. You don't need to pay anyone to open the account. Just reply to eBay messages. Don't be afraid to contact eBay about anything. It works the same with feedbacks. Just try to contact eBay to, to actually point to eBay's representative heart and they will reply you and help you to fix anything. So they even write here that if you had any listings that were removed, when the account was suspended, we've restored those listings to see this listing, go to my account and click activity and click unsold under the cell heading to release more actions. And so actually all of the listings were deleted. We don't have what to do about that. We just need to release them. If you have them in AutoDS, just click uh, on the few listings. You can mark them, then click bulk changes, released and everything will uh, be released on eBay. So again, my main point here is never afraid. Just contact eBay and don't be afraid to contact them and talk with them about anything you have. It was super easy. I don't know why people are so scary from this, but eBay taking these actions, not because they don't want you to sell on their platform. It's just something that ca that can happen if they feel risk, a security risk to their uh, site. It means that maybe eBay thought that you are using proxies or something like that, that can, that using that you can scam their buyers. And eBay don't want that. So we should understand their uh, side too and just follow their uh, uh, directions, show them that you are a real person, you are not trying to scam anyone and that's all. I hope that this video will help you to open more eBay accounts and actually build a dropshipping empire. See you in the next videos. Don't forget, forget to comment what do you think about this video. Uh, if it was helpful, like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel and share it with your friends. See you in the next videos. Bye bye.